In this video, we're going to look at how to convert between metric and imperial units for mass. Before we do this, it's useful to watch two of our videos, the first one on metric units of mass and the second one on imperial units of mass. And both of those are available on corbettmavs.com. Here are two useful conversion uh, facts which may be uh, useful to know. Uh, the first one is that one pound is approximately equal to 450 grams. And the second one is that one kilogram is approximately equal to 2.2 pounds. So, to convert from pounds into grams, you multiply by 450. An example being 10 pounds times 450 would be equal to 4,500 grams. And to go from grams into pounds, you divide by 450. So if you had your 4,500 and you divide it by 450, you go back into 10 pounds. Okay, and to go from kilograms into pounds, you times by 2.2. And to go back from pounds into kilograms, you divide by 2.2. So here's a couple of examples. The first one says convert two pounds into grams. So one pound is approximately equal to 450 grams. So two pounds, well, we're going to, to go into grams, we're going to times by 450. So two times 450 is equal to 900. So that means that two pounds is approximately equal to 900 grams. Okay, convert 50 kilograms into pounds. So one kilogram is approximately equal to 2.2 pounds. So to convert 50 kilograms into pounds, you're gonna times by 2.2. So we're gonna do 50 times 2.2. Okay, so whenever you times 50 by 2.2, you get that's equal to 110 pounds. So that means that 50 kilograms is approximately equal to 110 pounds. And finally, we wanna go back from kilogram, or back from pounds into kilograms. So now we're gonna divide by 2.2. So we're gonna do 10 pounds divided by 2.2. And when you do 10 pounds divided by 2.2, you get that is equal to um, 4.545454 and so on. Uh, so that's equal to 4.55. Uh, kilograms to two decimal places to two decimal places okay so it's just very important that you re remember these two conversion facts that one pound is approximately equal to 450 grams and that one kilogram is approximately equal to 2.2 pounds and these are quite useful to you know recap it if you need to